The big story, fuel tax fury. Governor Whitmer unveiling her first budget proposal. While it focuses on improving education and clean water, it's her plan for the roads and how to pay for it that's facing a lot of backlash tonight. As we first reported last night, Whitmer wants to nearly triple Michigan's gas tax. She's proposing a 45 cent hike to be phased in over 18 months. The governor says the state is at a crossroads and must make some bold investments to turn things around. We want to know where where do you think the state should get the money to fix the roads? Go to WXYZ.com slash vote to weigh in. Meantime, 7 Action News reporter Kim Russell is in Lansing with the challenges the governor is up against. Today here in Lansing, Governor Gretchen Whitmer laid out her proposal for how she plans to, quote, fix the damn roads. But does her plan even stand a chance? Governor Gretchen Whitmer told the House and Senate Appropriations Committees about her state budget plan. She wants to increase the budget by 3.6%. That general fund is the same size as it was 20 years ago. Let that sink in. She says the increase would help improve education, water quality, and the roads. She wants lawmakers to increase spending on roads with the 45 cent gas tax put in place over the next three years. The whole goal here is to make sure that we get to a spend level of $2.5 billion additional on our roads. If um, the majority leader or anyone else for that matter has a solution that gets us to that point, um, it still means we can pull a, a lever and fix all these problems and that's the goal here. Republican lawmakers who control the legislature are not on board. Senator Jim Runstead from Western Oakland County says he wants to look for wasteful spending to find money to improve the roads. We're going to have to go through the entire budget looking for efficiencies. And Senator Peter Lucido from Macomb County wants to see the law changed so that registration fees stay in the county they come from. Anybody could have said, just raise the taxes and we're going to make it all happen. This ain't happening on my watch. When reporters asked the governor if she thought her plan stood a chance, she said this. This is day one of the budget process. It's begun today. Yes. Um, there's a lot of different things that always move concurrently with budgets, and often conversations will touch on a couple things. We'll see. One thing we have learned, the budget proposal often has changed a lot before the actual budget is put into effect. We'll be following this process and let you know what happens. In Lansing, Kim Russell, 7 Action News.